Here are today's top stories. First, Conan O'Brien has revealed that his nightly show Conan will end in 2021 after 10 seasons on TBS. However, the host isn't ready to retire yet. After O'Brien's late night show wraps in June 2021, he'll then segue to a weekly variety series on HBO Max, which like TBS is owned by Warner Media. And O'Brien won't be leaving the cable network entirely. His Conan Without Borders travel specials will continue to air on TBS. O'Brien is the longest tenured current host of a late night show, having first hosted NBC's Late Night in 1993. We now have a new look at Zack Snyder's Justice League. If you can believe it, the original Justice League hit theaters three years ago today. To mark the anniversary, filmmaker Zack Snyder has unveiled a new black and white trailer for his cut of Justice League, which will appear in four one-hour episodes on HBO Max next year. <laughs> The Snyder Cut of Justice League comes after years of fan campaigning for the filmmaker to be allowed to complete his vision, after stepping away from the project in May 2017 following a family tragedy. Director Joss Whedon stepped in to complete Justice League, which underwhelmed at the box office. No release date has been set yet for Zack Snyder's Justice League. We know a TV spinoff of the forthcoming film The Batman is in the works at HBO Max, but now there's already been a switch up behind the scenes. If you are Justice The Hollywood Reporter can exclusively reveal that Boardwalk Empire creator Terrence Winter, who was poised to write and serve as showrunner on the Batman TV spinoff, has departed the series. Sources say creative differences are to blame for the split, as Winter's vision for the drama did not match what Matt Reeves and other producers had in mind. A search is underway for a new showrunner for the still untitled drama that has been going by the working title of Gotham Central. HBO Max and studio Warner Brothers Television declined to comment. For more on all these stories, head to THR.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Tiffany Taylor.